As you move into more illumination and more luminosity you become one who dwells on all levels, all surfaces, all layers of life. As you move fully into one who takes responsibility in the deep abyss of the inner thinking of your existence, then you become empowered. You need not weapons to protect yourself. You need not bulletproof vests to protect yourself or armies or navies. You need only the thought in every layer of your being that I am of pure light and I am of pure God. And nothing of earth can destroy this, harm this, or change this in any way. You all stand at the gateway at sunrise on a planet that still wears her veils of morning. You all look at this light as it rises in your sleepy eyes behind clouds of doubt. Your heart goes out, and your voice goes out, as you become one with what you yearn to experience. Open the gates of your being and feel truly and totally with your light. For the humanist crouches in the corner of self, but the light rises to meet the day, dances with the night, and rises to meet conflict without a droplet of fear, doubt, or darkness within it. As you move effortlessly into the upcoming year, there will be eclipses of the heart, total eclipses of dreams lost, and total eclipses of what appears to be your securities. All of this is but a fleeting energy, a passing of two ships in the night between now and the end of the year, you will be asked to cradle the babe within you, the Christ child within you. In apparent darkness, you will be asked to birth this Christ child without an external light. Using only the light of peace, and the light of love to illuminate what cannot be seen. You will take this babe in swaddling clothes and you will hold it up for all willing eyes to see, for it will birth you into all that you have held dear. For each of you that sit in this realm of light and knowledge, have proclaimed that it shall be nothing less than a place of peace, and love. You have proclaimed to your human molecules, I shall receive peace, I shall be healed, I shall be purified, and I shall be cleansed. And so it shall be. The vibration of shall is seven of nature declaring the spiritual warrior be set free. One who walks a narrow path within self and soul. Working for the light, by the light and with the light. Not being allowed to stray outside the boundaries of light for more than a fleeting thought. 7 brings you home the place where miracles are an every minute event. 7 is your natural state of being. Your ears will deafen to the loud calls of fear and your hearts shall leap past all the thoughts of danger and your light shall shine down upon all those that are afraid. Give to yourself this Christmas, the gift of peace. Give it in every thought. Give it in every word. And give it in every gift that you wrap and unwrap. For remember dear ones, it is the babe in swaddling clothes that you grace with your presence and your presence. Unwrap the divinity within you. You have mummified yourself into stagnation and now it is time to take off the wraps of the past. Do not let one aspect of your heart, stay wrapped in the swaddling clothes of Christmas past. For it is your duty as warriors of light dash to fight in such a way you don't raise your sword, you don't raise your anger, and you don't raise your fists to anything. For each drop of anger that you have within your own sphere of life adds to the turmoil and chaos of the world. You all stand at the apex of a new beginning. As a shaman who leaps off the side of a mountain knowing without a doubt that there is a portal of light you must leap without your securities. You must leap with love and with a knowing that nothing, nothing can destroy your peace, your unity, and your freedom. You always have pure light at your disposal. I, Michael, come to tell you. I stand with you, I stand for you. Everyone feels in their heart, they are right. Everyone feels in his or her heart that theirs is the ultimate truth. So we seek to bring peace and wisdom, and enlightenment to every person on earth. Expand your perspectives. Encompass 360 degrees of this inner sight and knowing. It is in that center point of seeing that you will understand what we speak. Stand tall in your light, fearless. I am Michael and I am your sword.